In the springtime, many military units around the nation and overseas take part in a memorial death march. Starting on April 9th in 1942, soldiers were marched for days throughout the Philippine jungles. Those who survived faced the hardships of a prisoner of war camp. Today, the Texas State Guard marched four miles in their memory. KTK's Kara Pritchard was there and has our story. A medical battalion of the Texas State Guard began marching from Camp Ford around 9 a.m. Saturday morning. What this army done to me? What this army done to me? It's been a couple of years since our unit has done a Batan Memorial March. So every once in a while you have to do it just to see who's as fit as they need to be. About 15 minutes into their march, the rain began to fall, putting things into perspective. The rain got a little chilly after a while, but then I also kept thinking when you put it in context of, of what those soldiers endured on the Batan Death March. He says 6,000 Filipino and American men died during the journey. A little walk in the rain didn't seem like such a big deal. The unit's march came to an end at Camp Fannin Memorial on the UT Health Northeast campus. The same ground thousands of soldiers trained for war. This is important for us so we don't forget some of the significant events that affected what we, who we are and, and what this country is all about. And to honor those who experienced one of the greatest atrocities of World War II, sacrificing their freedom, health, and in many cases, their lives. It's important, I think, for us to remember the history of, of this area where we have roots. Kara Pritchard, KETK News.